here on the beach, and I thought this would be the best place for us to read this story. Is this a house for hermit crab? So this is actually another book about habitats, and see if you can find some of the characteristics of the habitat where hermit crab live. growing too big for the house on his back. I think the wind's going to turn the pages for me. It was time to find a new house. He crawled up out of the water looking for something to hide in, where he would be safe from the prickle pine fish. So we know our houses are a type of shelter, and just like we need shelter, animals need shelter too. He stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. I'm looking at the ground and I almost see some places where maybe some type of animal scratch, scratched across the ground. Until he came to a rock. Is this the house for Hermit Crab? Turning himself around, Hermit Crab backed his hind legs beneath the rock. The rock would not budge. It was too heavy. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. Until he came to a rusty old tin can. Is this the house for Hermit Crab? When he tried to walk with the can on his back, it bumped and clucked. It was too noisy. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. Until he came to a piece of driftwood. And is this the house for Hermit Crab? Hermit Crab prowled deep inside the rounded howl at one end. It was too dark. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. Until he came to a small plastic pail. Is this a house for Hermit Crab? Climbing up towards the rim. Oops, he fell right in. He clawed, he clawed, until he climbed back out. It was too deep. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. I can hear some pretty bells in the background. I wonder if you boys and girls can hear that. Until he came to a nice round hole in the sand. Is this a house for Hermit Crab? He poked his head down into the opening. A huge pair of black eyes blinked back at him. Hermit Crab shivered as he scurried away from the big fiddler crab peering out of the burrow. It was too crowded. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. Until he came to a fishing net. Is this a house for Hermit Crab? Poking his claws into the heap, he got tangled and caught. Hermit Crab wiggled and wiggled until he found his way out of the net. It had too many holes. So he stepped along the shore by the sea in the sand. You know what comes next, right? Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. All of a sudden, a gigantic wave tossed and tumbled pebbles and sand over Hermit Crab's head. He swirled and whirled with the tide as he was washed back out into the sea. Boys and girls, I see the waves come a little bit closer to me right now. Maybe it's Sleeker than a shark, the prickle pine fish darted out from his hiding place in the tall seaweed. Every spine on its back stood straight at the steeple. Mouth open wide, it headed right for Hermit Crab. Hermit Crab raced across the floor. Scritch, scratch, scritch, scratch. Scurrying behind the first creature he saw, it was a sea snail. He hoped it would hide him. But the shell was empty. The shell was empty? Hermit Crab scrambled inside as quick as a flash and clamped his claw over the opening of the shell. The prickle pine fish circled the sand shell three times, but he could not catch sight of the crab he had been chasing. He glided off in search of something else to eat. When all seemed still and quiet, Hermit Crab snuggled comfortably down into his new shell. It was not too heavy, not too noisy, not too dark, and not too deep. It was not too crowded, and did not have too many holes. Boy, I 
just read a lot of describing words. Heavy, noisy, dark, deep. Sure, I'm glad we know about describing words. At last, Hermit Crab had found a new home, and it fit just right. Boys and girls, maybe we'll take a little look along the beach for a moment. See what you can see. Would it be a good home for Hermit Crab? Would it be a type of home that would